Hello, Masama. Where have we found? Hawaii. That might be the single best safari day we've had. Welcome to our first vlog of 2023. We're back. It's we been a while back. since we've done a vlog, but we're here. And we have just finished an amazing safari in Kenya that was put together by Alluring Africa. Nine days, nine days. Nine days, it was yep. nine days. And we're at the end of it. And we just did not expect how good it was gonna be. The wildlife here is amazing. We saw some real cool new Wait stuff. Wait till you guys see what we saw. Like, it was amazing. And we stayed at some beautiful camps. Um, from governor's camps. Yep. You know, we did a mix of like tented camps and some really glamorous accommodation. And we just had an amazing time. So without further, further ado. Cut and cue to B-roll footage. Let's go. So this morning we've made our way to Nakuru National Park, which is about an hour, hour and a half from Loldia House where we've been staying. And we're here for the whole day. We're gonna check out the park. It's quite vast. There's a lot of wildlife here. We already saw a bunch of buffalo on the way in, zebras, antelopes. There's supposedly cats here. We'll see if we're lucky enough to see them. Lots of uh, birds, lots of monkeys. Anyway, no shortage of stuff to see. So we'll just stop for a little coffee and tea break and we're gonna get going. Our beautiful safari I'm it just is, relaxing it is very peaceful here that's for sure what you're looking at hippos okay so it's nine o'clock or so and we're about to go on a night safari Yes, we are quite lucky because not all parks allow night safaris. This is one of the few places because it's a private conservancy that we can actually go do this. So hopefully we can spot some cool nighttime creatures. That was really cool. Actually way cooler than we expected. I did not think we were going to see that much. So that was awesome. All right. Time to get to bed. Tomorrow is an early wake up. Bye. So this afternoon what we're going to be doing is we're going to be using this device right here which is a radio frequency device that is going to help us locate some lions so the lions here have a collar on them and that's to help 
uh, help the conservancy know where they are located so that they minimize the interference between cattle and lions. So they have this very nifty device right here that I can turn on and we use it to scan the perimeter and to find where they are located. Uh, so we use this to go into the bush, find a location, and then hopefully we can track them and see them. So let's see if we're lucky. What's happening, Max? Tell us. Hear that sound? Doot! 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 That means we found one. Where have we found? They got set up here. The whole breakfast in the bush. And the kitchen. No leopards here. <laughs> We are here at the anti-poaching unit for the Conservancy and we are going to have a demonstration on how they use these bloodhounds to help track down poachers. So I'm going to be part of the demonstration. I'm going to have to go run somewhere and hide and I think they're going to find me pretty easily. Okay, we're here in the bush. We're a few hundred meters away from where we left the bloodhounds. I left my mark on the ground and we're going to see how long it takes for these hounds to find us. morning in the Mara again we've got balloons and we're watching a serval cat. Successful morning now we've stopped for a bit of breakfast. Yeah, it's been a few hours after our amazing serval and cheetah hunt uh, sighting and now we're on a new adventure. We have just heard word that there are uh, a leopard, a maybe a baby leopard, on the other side of the Mara River. So they're transferring us over on a boat and we're hopping in my car. I want to drive like maniacs to see if we can catch them. Let's go. single best safari day we've had. We had servals in the morning, cheetah hunt in the afternoon, midday, and leopard and leopard cub in the evening. So, stellar. Well, it is our last morning on safari here in the Mara. Uh, we're really enjoying this morning watching a whole pride of like 20 plus lions play around with some 
adolescent males that are just having some fun. And then we can see up there that the, uh, the big alpha male is still finishing up the elephant that we had seen yesterday. So we're just gonna enjoy our last morning here before flying back to Nairobi. We've made it back to Nairobi, staying at the beautiful House of Wayne just for one night. But before we say goodbye to Kenya, there's one more thing we need to do. And I think you guys are also going to like it. It's a beautiful place to finish our time here in Kenya at a lovely tea plantation right outside of Nairobi. Hope you guys enjoyed our travels as much as we did. The safari was amazing and it's such a beautiful place to finish off the trip. Thanks for joining in. Hope to see you next time wherever else it might be. Bye.